it's a pretty miserable day here in Nashville. Um, I figured I'd do like kind of a vlog. Um, I'm gonna do a workout. I think I'm just gonna bike and then I got some stuff to record. Um, so yeah. I have a buddy next to me. She always sits there. Hi, sweetie pie. What's up guys? It's Editing Alice with a voiceover. I wanted to teach you how to properly use a stainless steel pan. So they should be non-stick when used correctly, which means you just need to heat it up for a little while before you start cooking. So no oil yet, uh, you just need more time. Um, in the meantime, I'm gonna grab my eggs out of the fridge. We have these great ones from Trader Joe's, you'll see them in a second, uh, which are certified humane, which is the only regulated term when it comes to how chickens are raised. Uh, for right now, we have to buy them from Trader Joe's. When we move to Maine, I really hope to find a farm to support uh, and buy eggs there, but for now, it's Trader Joe's. So I have got my eggs. Um, and I'm gonna whisk it up real good. Now I'm checking the heat of the stainless steel pan. When your water beads around and looks like almost mercury uh, in the pan, you're good. You can turn the heat down now because the pan has expanded and it works. Um, I put some oil in, but I really didn't need to. Uh, poured the eggs in. And then I just kind of moved it around uh, until it was cooked and they came out pretty fluffy and nice. I'm not one to fear monger about toxins, but it seems like stainless, uh, not stainless steel, sorry, non-stick pans um, over time do, well, we know that they do have some kind of nasty chemicals in them and it makes me feel better to just cook in plain stainless steel. There's just a bit of a learning curve. Um, so I like a little bit of cheese on there. I like some toppings. Uh, I'll put a little hot sauce as well. I'm a baby, so I won't put a lot of it, but this kind of helps with like the egg ick. Uh, right now I'm trying to eat a lot of protein and eggs are really easy, but sometimes it's kind of gross. But if you season it properly, it's really not as bad. I'm putting some really good pepper on here and sea salt. And I'm pretty much good to go. I've been trying to take these bitters before every meal because uh, they're supposed to help with your digestion and bitter as a taste is supposed to help ground you and my anxiety is awful so I'm trying this. They taste like shit but anyway um, and then here's my favorite soda from Trader Joe's. I love this one and it's great as a mixer too. Um, okay that's it. I'm gonna eat. <laughs> You're so pretty. <laughs> yeah, you are. You're so pretty. Pro tip for recording if you're constantly cold is a heating blanket just sit on one because <laughs> it doesn't make any noise like a floor heater would um, and I get cozy as a bug in a rug um, and it's silent so it works really well
post tonight. Um, so I want to fix my hair a little bit because I want to wear it down. <sighs> Why do I keep saying what's up at the beginning of every clip? I sound, okay, whatever. I'm not gonna drive with the camera right here, but whenever I see vloggers do stuff, they're always like, I don't know, in their cars, but maybe that's because they all live in LA and they're all in tra traffic all the time. I'm trying to figure out a better place. Put it, there's no better place. Anyway, I'm gonna take it down before I leave. I need to pick up meds that have been sitting at Walgreens for a really long time. Hopefully if I'm brave enough, I'll get a clip of the tacos later that we're going to go eat. Nashville has the best options when it comes to Mexican food. Um, I'm excited. Okay, I'm gonna drive now and I don't want to crash. So I keep looking at myself in the monitor too. I'll get better at it. Okay, bye. in my back alley, so it's okay. I'm going like 10 miles per hour. Ooh. I just made a new playlist <laughs> called Delusional Girl that I listened to on the bike this morning. Now I'm listening to it again. Oh, am I gonna get fucking copyrighted? Maybe. Oops. I feel like that bitch with a vlog camera. You wanna see something really sad? Um, we had frosts come early again, well, come late again this year, and I planted a bunch of daffodils a couple years ago, and those buds look exciting, but there's no flowers in them. Because the frost got them. It's me! <laughs> what are you scared about? It's me! Hello! Part of the reason I want to start vlogging now is because when we go up to Maine this summer, I want to be well practiced. Oops. I want to be well practiced at editing and getting stuff done. Um, you're so cute. Um, and in a couple years, we're gonna move to Maine and build kind of like a homestead. And I really wanna record all that because I just wanna have it for posterity's sake. Is that the right word, posterity? Um, and also it's fun to put it on YouTube. Um, thanks for your butt, Evie. I'm gonna probably edit the clips that I already, I, I'm sorry, I keep looking at the, at the monitor. 
I'm going to probably edit the clips that I already have. Uh, and then maybe, I hope, I'll be brave enough to take a clip of dinner tonight. I don't know. I feel like if you had to guess, you would have already guessed this about me. But I hate, hate overhead lighting. Like, the darker it can be, the better. I love turning off lights. <laughs> um, but yeah, we have quite a nice collection here of some nice lamps. Um, most of them we've got from Ikea. Because uh, Ikea every so often will do these like really beautiful like lamps out of um, They have some marble ones some glass ones um, But yeah, here's some just cozy clips of me turning the lights on in our house 